Hello friends, today we are going to study charging of transfer RNA in this video. So welcome to the channel Learn With Me or I am Shilu Pachaudi. So now let's begin with the charging of transfer RNA. In our previous video, we have discussed how the mRNA is transcribed from DNA by the process of transcription. Then this mature mRNA will move to the cytoplasm. Cytoplasm will move karne ke baad, ribosomes akar attach ho jayenge, providing the site for protein synthesis. Or jitne bhi amino acids hain, they are transferred from the intracellular amino acid pool to the ribosomes by the transfer RNA. Jab tak transfer RNA se amino acid attach nahi hota, it is called uncharged transfer RNA. And once it is attached to the amino acid, then it will become charged transfer RNA. And the charging of transfer RNA occurs in two steps. The first one is activation of amino acid. And the second one is that activated amino acid will transfer to the transfer RNA. So now let's discuss these two steps in detail. The enzyme which is involved in charging of transfer RNA is amino acyl transfer RNA synthetase. Now the most important thing you have to remember is that each enzyme is specific for every amino acid. And we all know that we have total 20 different kinds of amino acids. Hote hai. That means we will be having 20 different kinds of amino acyl transfer RNA synthetase. Now, this enzyme have different binding sites. The first one is amino acid binding sites which is bind with the amino acid. Second, it has ATP binding site for ATP and the third one is transfer RNA binding site for transfer RNA. So the first step of charging of transfer RNA is activation of amino acids. Now there are around 20 different kind of amino acid occurs in the cytoplasm in an inactive state. So abhi ye kis state mein hai? They are present in the inactive state. Each amino acid before it is attached with a specific transfer RNA it is activated by the specific activating enzyme which is amino acyl synthetase enzyme. Now let's take an example of the amino acid methionine. It will bind to the amino acid binding site of amino acyl transfer RNA synthetase. This is the enzyme which is shown in this image. After that ATP, this is adenosine triphosphate. Tri kyun? Because three phosphates attach hain. Isliye hum isko kahenge ATP. Now this ATP will also bind to the ATP binding site of this enzyme. Two inorganic phosphate will be removed at this time resulting into the formation of adenosine monophosphate. Mono means one single phosphate is attached. Isliye hum isko AMP keh rahe hain. That is adenosine monophosphate. Now this AMP will bind with the amino acid resulting into the formation of amino acid AMP and enzyme complex. These three things are connected with each other jisko hum kehte hain amino acid AMP enzyme complex or though inorganic phosphates will be removed at this stage which is called pyrophosphate. And this complex is called amino acyl adenylate synthetase complex. Now this complex will combine with the specific transfer RNA. Just like if we take an example of methionine here, then methionine ka codon is AUG. That means the transfer RNA should have UAC in its anti-codon region. This transfer RNA will be methionine specific for methionine. Now this transfer RNA is uncharged at this time. It will bind to the transfer RNA binding site of the enzyme that is amino acyl transfer RNA synthetase. Just like this transfer RNA bind, AMP release हो जाएगा और amino acid और transfer RNA के बीच में bonds का formation हो जाएगा resulting into the formation of amino acid and transfer RNA complex और AMP इस time पर release हो गया है so at the end of this reaction we will get our charged transfer RNA that means transfer RNA is connected to the amino acid we will get the AMP and the enzymes will also be released at this time for 20 different kind of amino acid we have 20 different kind of transfer RNA and 20 different kind of enzymes in the cytoplasm. So this is how we get our charged transfer RNA that means our transfer RNA ab amino acid se connect ho chuka hai. So now let's quickly recap the process of charging of transfer RNA. Sabse pehle amino acid amino acyl transfer RNA synthetase ke saath bind karega in the presence of ATP resulting into the formation of amino acid and AMP complex or two phosphate remove ho jayenge that is inorganic phosphates and now the amino acid is activated. 
दिस अमीनो एसिड विल रिएक्ट विद स्पेसिफिक ट्रांसफर आर एन ए और ए एम पी जो यहाँ पर अटैच था पहले अमीनो एसिड के साथ अब वो रिलीज हो जाएगा और दिस अमीनो एसिड विल बाइंड टू द स्पेसिफिक ट्रांसफर आर एन ए एंड दिस प्रोसेस इज कॉल्ड चार्जिंग ऑफ ट्रांसफर आर एन ए और जो ट्रांसफर आर एन ए हमें मिलेगा उसको हम कहेंगे चार्ज ट्रांसफर आर एन ए नाउ इट्स अ क्वेस्ट टाइम एंड द क्वेश्चन इज विच इंजाइम इज इन्वॉल्व इन चार्जिंग ऑफ ट्रांसफर आर एन ए द ऑप्शन आर गिवन हेयर टू हैव टू आंसर मी इन द कमेंट सेक्शन अगर आपको वीडियो अच्छी लगी हो तो इसको लाइक और शेयर जरूर करिएगा सब्सक्राइब करना मत भूलेगा ताकि आने वाली वीडियोज आपको यूँ ही मिलते रहें थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग लर्न विद मी तब तक के लिए बाय टेक केयर